When elephants come upon the remains of another elephant, they grow tense and approach it cautiously. They quietly caress the bones, possibly attempting to identify the dead elephant. Elephants do not react this way when they encounter the remains of other animals, and this emotional display is one of the great mysteries of elephant behavior. A baby kangaroo, or joey, peers out of its mother's pouch. When newly born, a joey finds its way unassisted into the pouch and to a teat. It stays in the pouch until it is five to nine months old. When it finally emerges at six to ten months, it may still return to the pouch at any sign of danger. It stays close by its mother, continuing to suckle until it's twelve to eighteen months old. Then it separates from its mother to live an independent life. Each spring and fall, many types of waterfowl undergo spectacular migrations covering more than 2,000 miles. To find their way, they interpret a variety of clues, including the positions of the sun and the stars. Migratory birds often travel in V formations so that each bird is lifted by the updrafts produced by the bird in front.
Driven by instinct, mature salmon swim upriver to spawn or reproduce in the gravel stream beds where they were born. Where large dams block rivers, fish ladders provide a way for salmon to continue their upstream migration. Although their specific designs vary, all fish ladders consist of a series of pools, each slightly higher than the one below it. Salmon instinctively move from one pool to the next, struggling against the current much as they would in a natural river. As they approach their native stream beds, the fish stop eating and undergo dramatic physical changes in preparation for spawning. They turn brilliant red, and males develop severely humped backs and hooked jaws. At the end of their arduous journey, males and females form pairs, then deposit their eggs in the loose gravel. Every two to four years, female sea turtles come ashore to lay their eggs. In the protection of darkness, a female digs a shallow pit in the sand, deposits about 100 eggs, then covers the nest with sand before returning to sea. About two months later, the turtle hatchlings emerge. Instinctively, they scramble to the sea, guided by light reflected off the water or an internal magnetic compass. When they reach the water, the turtles enter the surf, then ride the undertow out to sea, where they probably drift with floating seaweed until they are strong enough to fend for themselves. Monitor lizards live in Africa, Southern Asia, and Australia. The family includes more than 30 species, including the largest lizard in the world, the Komodo Island Monitor, popularly known as the Komodo Dragon. Despite their lumbering appearance, monitors can move with significant speed for short distances. Monitors sometimes hide in brush or tall grass and lunge at unsuspecting prey ambling by. A monitor can open its jaws wider than its head, enabling it to swallow its prey in large chunks or even whole. <laughs> 